The Bulldog pride is stronger than ever before. That's the feeling in Huntsville with homecoming week in full swing at Alabama A&M. Way 31 weekend anchor Rob Sneed now joining us live from the quad on the campus. And Rob, what's everyone telling you about the big week and weekend ahead? Tori, there's so much to do at this week's homecoming uh, event and this weekend's homecoming game. I mean, you think about the music, the tailgating, you think about all of the events. They said it's certainly going to be lit, not only at the game this weekend, but it's already lit right now. Just a few moments ago, we saw the band out here practicing kind of where I'm standing right now. They sounded great. They're ready to go. They said that excitement is in the air. The Marching Maroon and White sh uh, Show Band of the South will surely keep the crowd hyped at this weekend's Alabama A&M homecoming game. It's in just uh, three days away, but there are so many things to do. As I mentioned earlier, you're talking about Friday. There, were, uh, there will be a Greek step show Saturday, a hip-hop concert featuring Big Boogie, Boosie, and Gorilla. Now, the university says nearly 30,000 students and alumni attended last year's game, and organizers hope for an even bigger turnout. The students I talked to express their pride in the university's heritage and its supportive, family-oriented environment. I would say that has to play a part with the school. We're very family-oriented. The moment that you step on campus, there is someone that's smiling at you, waving at you. There's always a helping hand. So I think that's what gives back to most alumni here, and that's the reason why we love our, um, our university. And, of course, just a correction, that step show will be actually on Friday. And, of course, uh, one of the organizers also told me that if you're going to come out this weekend, you want to make sure you have plenty of water, make sure you even bring a seat, and, of course, enjoy the events. They say that it is just certainly a good time. For now, I'm reporting live at Alabama A&M with coverage you can count on. Rob Sneed, Way 31 News.